I just realized that this whole vlog between baking and being in lab is just you guys watching me like do stuff with my hands. That sounds dirty. Is this what growing up is? By the way, I have to do my taxes this weekend. <laughs> I'm just so tired and I just want to break. I don't know if you've noticed this. Okay. Connie never lets me speak. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> Is it going to dry? I don't know. What's the vibe? Vibe is we're making it work. Okay, so originally I was praying all day for a snow day, but that didn't happen. I have to leave my apartment for class in an hour, so I guess we're really doing this thing. The snow wasn't that bad, but I am a little bit excited because we're doing our first crown prep today, I think. And I don't know, it just looks like super satisfying. Some people have ASMR and slime videos. I have crown prep videos. <laughs> wow. Apparently this wasn't enough snow to cancel school. Alrighty, lashes are on, scrubs are on. <sighs> Time to do this thing. If you want to cancel class now, you can cancel at any minute. No? Okay. It's like we're roasting marshmallows. <laughs> this is way less fun. Like, look at it. <laughs> Okay, okay, are you ready? Okay, okay, okay go. Oh no, no, I think it's okay actually. I think it's like gonna work. I just need to like aerate this a little bit better. So I do this, I do this on the top. Yeah, okay, and then put this onto this. Oh, it's a weird thing ready to do it. Like, um, I get why you guys don't say it that one. <laughs> I don't know if this is enough. I'm not the issue. Oh. Are you going back it? I don't think so. It's like when you ask someone. Okay. I can, like, push from here to... Yeah. Like this? Okay. And then flip that way. Do you have any more extra? This is how much extra. Oh, we're both. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna take it out. Don't touch anymore. Do you think it's ready? I don't know. Aren't they like it shouldn't bounce back? But then I'm like, what is bouncing back mean? It bounces back if you jump in. I think it's ready. I'm so scared. <laughs> I just want to wait like one more minute. Okay. Wait, show me what you did for this. This looks really good. Was this part fun? Um, yeah. How is it? I think it's good. Wait, what side did I do? <laughs> this one? Side. Oh yeah, then I think that's enough. Yay! Yay! Okay, we're only doing this side, so disregard yeah, this. This is, my <laughs> this is great! This is my next one. <laughs> yeah. both of them. I mean, he's flying there. He really is. He's just oh. out of here. I've learned to breathe oh my God. during this. Can you teach me how? I wish I was so good at something. You are good at a lot of things. Why you gotta say it like that? I don't like how you guys just pour it in there and don't measure. No, okay, no. <laughs> that just stresses me no, out. No, you've like, you've changed my ways because now I do this. Thank you. <laughs> What's the point of putting it in the cup? It's so smart. Because remember when we had to do like five scoops at a time? I would be like... <laughs> oh, yeah. And then he was like, you just pour it all into one and then do it all. Two axiom. It's the same thing. Same thing. Yeah. This side. I kept being good. Happy Valentine's Day to us. Well, actually, it's the day before Valentine's Day, but we got miso soup. We got spicy sushi combos. We got some nigiri, some hand rolls, tempura, crab rangoon. This is the average weeknight <laughs> in the pharma dental household. I'm mad. No, I'm mad. I'm just tired because... I'm just questioning existence. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm mad because I have meetings. Um, I'm mad because right now... She's mad because she has meetings and she hasn't gone to the last... Hey! I'm just so tired and I just want a break. Hello, Pharma Dental community. It's me. The guy that's always talking and then Connie cuts him. <laughs> I don't know if you've noticed this. I'm Connie not... never lets me speak. So now I'm taking over. Just so you know, I'm going to cut that off when I edit it. You're going to be like, she never lets me talk. She never lets me speak. <laughs> Okie dokie, this is lunch. I know it looks a little bit weird, but I was really craving like a super fried scrambled egg the way that my mom used to do it growing up. So I just did rice with sesame oil, scallions, fried eggs, spinach, and corn. Um, it's a little bit too watery. Just wait to put it on then. 
Or put it back in your thing. Uh, I don't know about this. Put it back in your bowl and just add out. I, just I don't have that. Just alternate. Well, we don't have any That's more. the problem. That's what I'm working on. No, we do. We have a little more. Oh, wait. Uh, wait, look. hold on. Oh, no, I told you. I'll just, is it going to dry? I don't know. What's the button? Five days, we're making it work. I'll Does it have to be 10 minutes? Or is it? Wait, it's still videoing. Good. I'm still on the vlog. Okay, this looks really bad, but we can actually use this side, so it's not that big of a deal. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Let's pause. Introduce yourself. My name is Hidan Fadal. Do the Good morning, world. So today I actually don't have class class, but I'm going into lab again, of course. Um, just because I need to practice. I'm so tired because last night I didn't get home until like 7.30. It was really fun though. I was assisting my big in clinic and I got to assist with an amalgam, which is nice because we like never really see amalgams in clinic. And I feel so lucky because I have so many upperclassmen friends in my group practice. So I had a great time like getting to hang out with them and cleaning up with them. And like... are sleeping. Oh, shiny side up. Just put the shiny side up. Shiny side? Is this the shiny? I have the sweetest little in the entire world. I was in lab and then she just dropped off this amazing ube tart that her mom mailed her for Chinese New Year. I've never had ube tarts before, but these are so good and so beautiful. Like, look at the color. Okay, so this seems very simple, but apparently... I just drill some holes into this baby. Even this thing. Anna, do you know how to take off this thing? I never know how to put anything in and out here. Oh, oh, it is that other burr. Okay. Time to change the burrs again. I think it's the one. Let's just go for it now. Good morning, you guys. I'm wearing my plaque is whack t-shirt. Still laying in bed and it's already 9.22, which feels really late, but man, I was so tired. I couldn't even vlog yesterday's three labs because I, I was I was just so tired. I think I'm still tired. But anyways, thankfully I have today off. I realized yesterday through how hard the day was that I feel like I've grown a lot in the last few months, which is kind of cool to see. Here's an example of what I mean. I don't know if this is simply just a product of me like caring less. I don't know, it's, it's, it's not about caring less, 
but it's more about like caring less about the little things. I feel like my life up until this past year, I would have been really upset if things don't go my way in lab, if I fall behind in lab. And I feel like yesterday we had three labs in a row and one of them, two of them, I didn't get anything checked off. And then the one before that, I like didn't complete everything. And like, it's really not a big deal. Like I don't want to come across as like a lazy person. Like these are just soft checks. But normally I would have been like, no, but like I still have to keep up with everything. And I've kind of become more at peace with how things are because I, I feel like I can see a bigger picture now. Like it's not about worrying about like the grades or staying on top of timelines or anything like that anymore. It's, it's like, I know personally what I have to do in order to master something and I know that like me getting one thing checked off is, isn't gonna mean that I mastered it. So I feel like more at peace, I guess, because now I'm kind of like, well, the point isn't to just get a check off, the point is to get good at something. Is this what growing up is? By the way, I have to do my taxes this weekend, so future me editing this. Make sure you do your taxes. Yeah, I don't know, I'm just like proud of myself because I think that this mindset is what you need in order to have like the endurance to get through dental school, so for anyone out there that's currently in school like struggling or feeling like you're kind of drowning <laughs> um don't worry we all go through it we're all basically drowning but over time i think you kind of just get used to drowning and that's my motivation for the day so i feel like i spent a lot of time in pharmacy school especially feeling super like burnt out feeling behind feeling not worthy yada 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 i just like sharing where i'm at mentally with these vlogs and such so <laughs> I haven't had a peanut butter and jelly in like probably a year, I would say. Cause like when do you really like eat these, you know? Okay, dokie, we just got back. They had a deal for their soaps and there's something about their soap where I feel like it's such a bougie luxury for me. I don't know, I feel like I grew up with just like normal like dollar soap from the store or whatever. So anyway, it's time for a soap haul. Gotta show them the rest of the haul too. Jimmy wants me to underwear show underwear haul. Underwear. <laughs> That's it. I don't know why there's such stigma around buying new underwear, but it's okay to buy new underwear when you have holes in your old ones. And I just want everyone to know that. I don't think there's a stigma for buying new underwear. <laughs> okay, anyways, first up on this soap haul, we got vanilla coconut. In all honesty, I just got this because I love the packaging and I think it's so cute. Okay, soap number two. Jimmy picked out this aromatherapy one. It's chamomile and bergamot, so. And next, I got champagne toast. This is one of my favorite candle scents, actually, so I'm excited. Also, all of these soaps are gonna be the foaming kind because I just think the foaming kind is nice. Next is peach bellini, which, oh wait, peach bellini actually is my favorite scent. I think champagne toast is my second one. We got Cactus Blossom, this is one of my OG favorites. Their candle is so good. So both Cactus Blossom and Champagne Toast kind of just smell a little like perfumey and nice. And last but not least, Jimmy also picked this one out. It's just Sun Drenched Linen. It's a good classic to have. We'll probably keep this in the kitchen too. We had just half a cup left. My hands are clean, by the way. I just realized that this whole vlog between baking and being in lab is just you guys watching me like do stuff with my hands. That sounds dirty. I'm pretty excited that Connie is making some tahini cookies. Uh, it sounds quite fascinating to me. Um, I have a feeling it's just gonna be kind of a more disappointing version of a peanut butter cookie. Uh, but, you know, I'm, I, I remain hopeful. Uh, you know, Connie neglected to mention that while she was very stressed and everything, I was a great boyfriend and made salmon 
potatoes and zucchini. And what did she say when I put it on the plate? Not thank you for being an amazing boyfriend, but you didn't add enough salt to the potatoes. Sorry for trying to keep us healthy. I have hypertension. I used to take lisinopril. I should still be taking lisinopril, uh, but I don't take it. Uh, I have a primary care appointment soon. Maybe I'll start taking it again. Uh, but it was a pretty good kind of simple weeknight meal. I threw it together. It only took like 30 minutes to do. Something you guys could do as well, for sure. Uh, I did learn that if your potatoes are growing spores, you're supposed to cut them out. I kind of instinctively did that anyways before, but today is the first day that I had confirmation that it was bad to eat those. Uh, and now I'm gonna go play some Paper Mario. The new Paper Mario for the Switch. Pretty good game if we have, uh, you know, any fans of the Pharma Dental that cross into uh, enjoying video games. I think there's probably about seven of you out there. Uh, you're, you're probably, you know, enjoying this, uh, this part of the video that Connie's gonna edit out. This is, <laughs> this is gonna stay. Yeah. I'm already thinking of ways I can, like, <laughs> I think eventually we'll have enough content of me uh, vlogging uh, for Connie to make a whole video that's just about me when she's not feeling like filming anything for the week. Uh, I'm quite the star. Uh, I'm a Leo, which means I'm kind of like a look at me type person. Love to be the center of attention. Love to, you know, tell stories at parties and stuff. Can't really do that anymore with the COVID. Oh, that's a winner. Um, right but anyways. <laughs> this is like so funny to listen to. Because you're like waiting for them to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> I, that's how you know that I'm very aware that I'm funny is because I pause for laughter when I'm recording vlog videos. I'm also not really good at like 